Blake. What are we doing? One more dinner won't hurt and you know it. Well, that depends. One more dinner won't hurt me or won't hurt you. Riley, what are you getting at? Do you even remember the first time I made you this meal? Or the first time you kissed this cook? How could I forget? That apron was a cheap ploy. Plus, you burnt the hell out of the asparagus. There is no forgetting that. So you're saying you're a sucker for cheap ploys. <laughs> Why are we doing this? I mean, we're not together, right? Yet, here you are, in your pajamas, at my house, in the middle of the night. Exactly. Eating the same dinner as we had on our first date. I mean, really, there's gotta be better ways for us to spend our time together, you know? Well, this is the way I want to remember things. I didn't exactly have a choice, now did I? It's easy to forget when you're the one to actually let go. Blake. Baby. Life is too short to waste your time dwelling on the past. You have to live here and now. Okay, whatever that means. After my accident, you told me that, remember? Your accident. How could I ever forget? Never thought that something like that would have brought us to a place like this. I had to let you go. And I'm sorry. But you just have to understand I was looking out for you. Okay, we have too many things in our life to deal with as it is and I just couldn't be another one of those things. I don't even know what I'm living with anymore. Just a bunch of nights we've already had. You know, we spend a third of our lives sleeping. The guy at work told me that today. You back at work already? Just listen. He said that he can completely control his dreams. It's like some real life Sims shit, you know? First thing he does is fly, like with his body, followed by sex with Kate Beckinsale, of course. <laughs> Sounds like a stand up guy. The trick is to realize that you're dreaming in the first place and then once you get there, your mind becomes its own travel destination. That's like a place where there is always an answer to the right question. What does that mean exactly? Nah, I don't know. But he told me that when his dog died, all he had to do was go to sleep, and then there they were going to the dog park with Kate Beckinsale. Think about it. Visiting with dead people? I mean, imagine dead me walking around your dreams like I'm alive or something. <laughs> what a trip. Blake. Blake. The asparagus is done. Blake. The asparagus is done. <laughs>